Hi, this is Vikas. This is just a quick video about some tips and tricks for using Osiris as an examiner. So if it's not already loaded, go down to the dock and click the icon, which is the green triangle. You'll find the databases listed down here on the left hand side. So select yours and the convention is to use the first three letters of the first name and first three letters of the last name. So we single click the database here. That brings up a list of the cases. So there are three cases in this database. I use the comments 2 box to write in the diagnosis and comments 3 to give the difficulty from 1 to 4 um, and I sort the cases using comments 3 and this helps me to show the cases in increasing order of difficulty and only I can see the diagnoses. So single click the particular case you want up here that brings up a panel of the series available and then from that double click the one that you want to show don't double click up here because you may well end up showing an image that you don't want to as your first image. So double click down here. The first time you do that you get this warning notice, click I agree and your image comes up. If there's more than one image in this series you can use a scroll button to scroll through them and it will show the different images. The icons up at the top allow you to window, pan, magnify or rotate the image. If during all of that everything goes wrong you can click the reset button which will bring it back to normal. If you want to be able to see all the different series available during this view just drag this bar over to the right and you can see them all or you can keep it hidden so that the candidate can't see this on their screen. Once you finish with this case if you click database that resets it and takes you back to this view. When you're examining dual screen mode remember you'll see this screen and the candidate will see this screen. If you want to show them additional series to this one, hover over to your screen where you can see the other series and double click one and they should open up side by side. Once you've finished, click database and it will take you back to this screen. Okay, I hope that helps. Bye.